Hey guys, how y'all doing? And yes, you see the title of the video. It's the SpongeBob SquarePants The Patrick Star Game announced trailer. Joy of Joys. Patrick Star, who you might remember as a starfish in SpongeBob SquarePants, yes, sadly is going to be getting his own game. Why? Just why? Patrick? And I hate to and I hate to use this term, but Patrick is a loser. Think about it. He lives under a rock. He's done nothing with his life. You literally don't um, unless SpongeBob is involved in the plot, you don't hardly see Patrick get involved at all. So, yeah, I, and I do apologize for saying that Patrick's a loser, but you guys got to admit there is some validation to that. Think about it, Patrick. Literally, I don't know how in the world. He, ha he hasn't been blacklisted by his landlord and literally kicked out of where he lives. But anyway, let's go check it. Let's go check this out and see what it's about. Remember, it's called the SpongeBob SquarePants The Patrick Star Game Announced Trailer. And by the way, you can find this trailer and all the other trailers I've reacted to today on the PlayStation YouTube channel, by the way, if you if you want to go check them out, if you want to go check it out, so, yeah. So, let's go check it out and see what it's about. Okay, looks like looks like the game is set in, you know, you know, Sponge and Bikini Bottom. And, and... Wait. Again. How the heck is Patrick able to afford his home if, number one, he doesn't have a job, number two, he literally ha... Okay, wait. Sponge... I mean... SpongeBob has a job. He works at the Krusty Krab, right? I can understand how SpongeBob can afford his place, and Squidward I can kind of understand too because he works. He also works at the Krusty Krab. But how does Patrick afford a home when he doesn't have a job and he has no money at all? Does that make sense to anybody else? Weird. Oh dear God, Patrick, what are you do? What are you doing, you tank idiot? I am seriously starting to wonder: is is Patrick like not as bright as he appears to be? Or is he faking all of this to avoid actually being responsible? That's my guess, anyway. What? Okay, wait. Wait. This game looks familiar. No, this game does look familiar. Think back to Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. And you remember how you had to, I had to smash like, smash like, um, <sighs> tables and, um, uh, things like that? Yeah, remember that? It's literally the same game, but instead of a SpongeBob, it's Patrick this time. 
I mean, I cannot be the only one who's noticed that. Really? So they, so they really, re really just rehashed the same idea. Really? They really could. They really couldn't come up with an original idea for this game. The Patrick Star game. That's really what they're calling it. The Patrick Star game. Really? You couldn't have called it something like Patrick Star. Patrick Star's Adventures or the Adventures of Patrick Star, something like that. And by the way, guys, it's coming October 4th, 2024. So, so if you like SpongeBob and you and you have a PS4 or PS5 and whatever other systems it's on, and you want to pick it up, knock yourself out. And people, this is why I keep saying we need to have both digital and physical releases of games. Again, I'm, and I'm going to say this again, and, I'll, and I'm not going to keep... And I'm not, fuck, I was going to screw that up. And I'm not kidding about this. Okay, like, what if a person has, like, really slow internet service... And that's the only kind of internet service they can afford. That's where physical comes in. That way you don't have to worry about that. With digital, God only knows, people. So, yeah. So, yeah, that was the SpongeBob SquarePants, the Patrick Star Game announced trailer. So guys, what did you think? Personally, I thought th I thought that I thought that trailer was it was okay. I mean, it was well done, but you know, frankly, it gets uh, about a uh, five in terms of presentation. It gets a. Uh, Six in terms of, you know, actually telling us what the game is about. And it gets a three in terms of, in terms of the story because it explained almost practically nothing. Yes, I'm aware it's an announced trailer. Maybe when the actual official trailer comes out, it'll explain more. Yeah, so overall, what do I give this trailer? I'm going to give it about a four, four and a half maybe. I mean, the trailer was okay, but it, but it just needed that little, it just needed that little something extra. It just needed a little extra time to cook, so to speak. So if you guys did enjoy this video, and I hope you did, go ahead and leave a like on the video. Share your thoughts in the comments down below. If there's a game trailer you want me to react to, leave it in the comments down below, and I'll, and I'll get to it as soon as I can or when I can. And if I've already done your request, feel free to check out your request. Share the video around for those who wish to see. And my friends... And this is the important one. Do not forget to subscribe for more of me and these videos you shall see. And until ne and until next time, later fam squad.